Also developing this morning, a hearing today will determine whether important documents in the Delphi murders investigation will remain sealed or be released to the public. CBS 2's Marissa Perlman live with the latest details on this case. Marissa, so many people watching this very closely. That's right. Audrina Ryan, it's been one month since Richard Allen from Delphi was charged with two counts of murder in the killings of two teen girls. But after his arrest, the court documents were sealed at the request of the local prosecutor. And today we could hear about two big developments in this case. First, Allen himself has submitted a petition to be let out on bail. He and his lawyers are calling for the judge to either reduce his bail or for him to be released on his own recognizance. Meanwhile, a brief has been filed with the court to unseal those charging documents. Indiana law does allow courts to withhold records in extraordinary circumstances, but an attorney not connected to the case says it's likely the judge will move to publicly release that information. He has to argue why that policy should not be followed by the court. And there has to be some overriding interest that's above the open records law. That's what he needs to argue. Threat to someone's life, other investigations that might identify other suspects that might flee. Now, Allen is facing two counts of murder in connection with the killings of Abby Williams and Libby German in February of 2017. The hearing takes place this morning at 8. We'll bring you full coverage on air and on CBSChicago.com. Live in the newsroom, Marissa Perlman, CBS 2 News. Audrina. Marissa, thank you for the latest on that. I